This is instruction on preparing your vocabulary Prezi. The first thing, of course, that you need to do is to go onto the internet, open up the Prezi website, and get to your main page. The first thing you'll want to do is to open up a new Prezi. Uh, it does not matter what you call this, so let's just call this one Vocabulary 1, and uh, click on New Prezi. Then you need to enter your data. Now understand you're only going to do one Prezi and you're going to have all of your words in the same. So we'll do a couple here and then I'll go to one that's completely prepared. So um, we'll start by inserting a word and let's say we're going to use malice. And uh, so the word is malice. Click on the white space, decide what size we want it, decide what attitude we want it. Then we're going to put in, let's say, the definition, uh, which is uh, ill, will, or spite. And we can type that in. And we can decide what size we want it. We can make it smaller any way we want. And uh, then we're going to put in the quotation. So we'll use uh, Abraham Lincoln's uh, with malice toward none. Abraham Lincoln, we'll need to correct our capitalization issue there. And uh, then again, decide how big we want it, where we want it, how we want it spun, and uh, then we need to insert a picture. Now, what you need to do is to uh, find the pictures online. They should be high definition because uh, Prezi does not work well with uh, low definition pictures. Uh, and then save the pictures to your computer so that when you get ready to put a picture in here, all you need to do is to click on the insert bubble here click load file it will take you to your pictures and then choose a picture and in this case we want somebody showing malice this guy's a good candidate it'll load it in the middle of your screen you can click put it where you wish and uh, again however you wish it spun and then click now we need to move on to the next word we're out of space here so if we move our cursor to the right, left click, we drag the, uh, uh, our desktop over here. We can now enter uh, a word. We can enter a definition. We can enter um, a quotation. And then we can insert another picture as well. So this dog's cute, so we'll put the dog in here, slide him over there, and then spout, and then move on to your third word, fourth word, fifth word, etc. Until you end up uh, with uh, 20 items on your Prezi. Then you're going to have something that uh, looks like um, this Prezi here, which was prepared by a student last year. Um, and where did it go? Here we go. So we'll open it up. And your Prezi as yet does not have a path on it. So uh, you click Edit Your Prezi and you want to put, uh, put a path on this thing. So you go up to here and you click on Path. Now we'll get rid of this path by clicking Delete All. Notice that by scrolling on your uh, mouse you click the thing or small. So the first thing we do is we click on one of the words. Let's say that's where we're going to start. And let's see what it is. It's destitute. Let's find uh, a definition for destitute. And uh, that would be extremely poor. It's down here. Uh, so then we will 
spot you will find there's a picture of a destitute person a quotation about uh, somebody being destitute so we have that we're going to go word definition picture quotation so now we move to another word this word is erudite so we want to have uh, the definition of that which is scholarly and learned rigor that would be a big book then a quotation about uh, you know the word uh, erudite and uh, that is here then we go on to another word culmination we want to find um, a uh, definition of cul culmination so we drag around uh, highest point of attainment here we go and then we were going to go to the picture is here and then we're going to go to the uh, to the quotation and uh, let's see uh, and this uh, is using culmination and we go to a, the next word concur the definition of the picture this person is uh, uh, concurring and uh, then we go to the quotation using concur then we go to the final word which is dilemma the definition for dilemma the picture of a dilemma and the quotation and then we are done so uh, to just test it I would then click on show and um, and you can click on the arrows here that's gonna we want to go back to the very first uh, thing which was destitute click on you got your definition your picture uh, your quotation word definition picture quotation word definition picture quotation etc and so this is just fine so we'll go back up here we will exit now you need to send the link to me so you click exit and if you remember correctly from your previous um, Prezi you'll get this screen and there's this thing here that says get link click on it copy it and then go to um, fusion page go to Google applications Google Docs normal um, log in click on create new create new document paste the link here and then go up to the untitled and we're going to entitle this block number and then the last name this we'll call this good and then vocabulary one and just make sure that you have your capitalize your last name and there's a space between your block number and a space between your last name and the title click OK click share you want to type in here teacher floor at battlefield high school dot org and make sure the can edit is showing and then click share and you are finished thank you if you have any questions please see me